One week before the ECIS conference, you can see my mustache is growing out. Feels a bit thick here, feel a bit light here. Well, I have to fix that. But I'm making this uh, video because I know a lot of you will be at the ECIS conference next week. And um, I figured the theme is creativity. <clears throat> and if you've got some free time and uh, you want to see some creative things around uh, this area um, I'm just gonna bike to those areas I highly recommend if you're here see if you can rent a bike because the places I'm going to are best taken by bicycle also something to remember um, temperatures here are doesn't seem as cold as other places but the wind chill is really high so if you have a weather app you're not only looking at the temperature, but you're looking at the wind chill. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pan around. Right next to the Bella Center, you can sort of see right over there, there's actually a metro stop. And uh, one of the places I'm going through to is uh, it's a figure eight building. It's made by the big uh, corporation. But if you want to go there, you can take the metro um, and you take the metro in that direction um, it will take you right there and you can get off or you can get a bike and you can bike along this beautiful park that surrounds the the Bella Center um, and what's nice about the park is they've got camping spots so if you go to any of the hardware shops around here you can pick up some logs go to the camping shop and or go to the camping site and then uh, have a little campfire right near here it's, it's kind of nice That's my bike, and here we have these architectural, these are brand new, um, it looks like this is a, a part of Copenhagen, it's, my understanding is it's not an area that uh, most Copenhagen residents want to live, so what's happened is you've got a well-known architects that have made really beautiful buildings so you've got amazing architecture amazing uh, apartments they have fantastic light um, they have green roofs they have um, with this one building over there in the far side it's a figure eight so that it's designed that all apartments get light and there's actually a ramp that sort of goes around. There's a TED talk about this. So we have a proposition to the local residents make a really beautiful uh, apartment. There's probably gonna be bigger square footage than what you find in the city, it has elevators. <clears throat> and even though you're in an area that's very windy, you've got access to this beautiful park. That's the selling point here. Yeah, you're far away from the city. You're close to the airport. 
and typically being close to the airport is not something you like but this is an interesting proposition and I think our people are starting to buy into it. Success, uh, found a camping uh, spot and this is an example of where you can set up a fire. All you need to do is go to a hardware shop, there's always uh, wood being sold and then come here, start the fire, have a little picnic. I'm not going to invade this one because there's actually a, I can see someone has set up a tent but very possible to come here and have a little campfire. Alternative uh, lunch break. It'll take a while to get here, maybe half an hour by bike, but worth it. To the right of these buildings is a nature center. Actually, it looks, it looks like a good place to rent a bike. If you just take the metro down here and walk here, and um, it looks like they have a bunch of green bikes there. I'm guessing that's for rental. 